Hey guys, just before we start, I uh, please subscribe to my channel. It will it'll really help me out. I'm posting build about tutorials uh, a lot in the past few days. So, anyways, let's get into the tutorial. So, I'm going to separate this into needs and wants. The needs is you need it to build this, and the wants is you should probably have it. So, the needs, you need the screwdriver tool, and you need, well, blocks. You will need either, you, you will need the piston block, and you will either need the cake block, or the lever block, right here. The wants of this is the scaling tool. It'll make your life a lot easier, and it'll make your suit look a lot better. Uh, you will also probably want where is it i'm trying to find it um oh you'll probably want dynamite because that's how your attacks your attack is going to do anything uh, and you need a, a button unless you have a lever but you also need a button to activate the superpower anyways let's get into this so if you have all those items on the list then good for you we're going to be building our suit really high in the air so that we can fit all the special attacks you think i think you know where i'm going with this so to build your suit Place a cake block right here, but or or yeah, you won't uh, unless you're using a lever. But uh, if you're using a uh, lever block, then you should probably like just angle up the armor of where it's going to be, and it doesn't really matter where you put the lever block. To be honest, anyways, so well, you need to put the lever block right here, and you just you need to make the armor touch the leaf block so that, that when the leaf block is attached attached to you the leaf block is attached to the armor so then you know that's how it works so i'm just gonna make some quick armor so to make armor if you have scale tool if you don't you can just do a brick or something i don't know but if you have scale tool then we can make armor so you gotta fit it right really nice like that yep like this yep all right now let's add some chest some uh, shoulder pads so where there's two types that I'm going to show you today. I'm going to show you the laser beam power up and the earth quake power up, I guess. So, in your mind, choose which one you you think sounds cooler. You're probably going to choose a laser beam and you don't lie to me. You 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 know you're going to choose a laser beam cuz, you know. But you can have both as well, but you just need to fit everything together, which is a little bit annoying. So, I'm going to show you some examples of attacks and some examples of armor at the end of the video. So stay tuned if you're running out of ideas like me. And like that. So we have our nice shoulder pads. I'm not the best. At, I'm not in my armor making mood right now. So don't blame me if the armor looks like poop. So here we go. And we're just going to add uh, some fancy stuff on it. So we're just going to belt or something. Because, you know, you need the belt to keep pants up. If you don't have a belt, then... um. Pip. Okay, yep. Looks good to me. Now we just color it. So I'm going to do like a hunter kind of armor. So green, brown pads, brown belts, and a nice little center thing. You can customize the armor however you want. So here's my armor. It, it's not the best, I know. Also, you probably need anchor blocker on. So... Now that you have the armor, you can you're free to get up because if you put the cake down, the cake's gonna be attached to the armor. So now we need to make the special moves. So to start making the special moves, I'm gonna do both. So we're gonna get this is where the screwdriver tool comes into to play. Just delete that. So what you want is you need this to be invisible when you're, when we're done with it. So with the laser beam, the laser beam, but you will probably need a car seat for the laser beam because you need to pull it in for you to save it so let's just get our piston so what we want to do is this piston when the button when the button is pressed on the armor the piston will push the laser beam up and it'll spring into act to action so we're gonna just put it here and I'd say we just need to press the piston and see what length we want it at. So that's a tad bit too high. So I'm thinking seven. You need to come up just like at the bottom of the armor. Come on. I'm kind of short. 
and yep that's perfect all right now we can start making the laser beam i'm short okay now to make the laser beam i've made a tutorial on the laser beam already but i'm just gonna do it for anyone that hasn't seen so you're you're gonna want any block but neon is preferred because it looks super cool and what you want what you're gonna want to do is you just get a bunch of pistons i'm gonna turn them off match rotation because it's just gonna make my life a lot easier you just get a bunch of pistons the more pistons the bigger the laser beam so now get an ultra jetpack or any jetpack really because you need a f or just build up or something because we need to be up here and now we have to extend all of them and we probably want uh we probably want uh the anchored off setting off so give me a second all right now that we have all of our unanchored lasers now we can begin making the laser beam so what you want to do you want to activate all of them yeah, like this. So see how long your laser beam is and see if you're happy with it. So click all these. I'm going to click away. Click, 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 click. Oh, man. This is like cookie clicker all over again. Right, now that we've got all of our little pistons extended. Now, that is a very intensely long laser beam. It's going to do a lot of damage, you know. So now, to make the laser beam... This is going to be a very lengthy process because this is quite a... It's, this is quite the chunky laser beam, I must say. So you want to anchor it off and basically what you want is you want to get your neon blocks and... Or dynamite if you're doing like an attack laser. So, But I'm just going to do neon. You might want to like stick dynamite inside the neon if you want the laser beam to explode things. But I'm just going to do like a harmless kind of laser. I know, I'm boring. Uh, I don't want to explode things, I don't know. So now you just do this and repeat the process until you've all reached all the way to the end. Also, just a quick little thing. If you want to do a fireball, like a uh, thing that you can shoot and it's very long range, you can just put like a thruster underneath and it'll like shoot up, like the thruster collision off. Anyway, so I have finished my giant laser beam. So now what we need to do, we the laser beam is basically done. You can put dynamite inside of it if you want to do damage once again. Now we just need to keybind it. So let's color all of these pistons whatever color you want. But I'm going to do red because, you know, red is laser beam. Yeah, I missed one. Okay. So then we will, then, then the laser beam is basically done. So we just add a button. And then we're going to do the earthquake move, which is personally my favorite. But I know you guys are going to think the fireball is the coolest. But anyways, so, um... We are done our little, our, our, our giant, may I say, laser here. So now we just leave it. We just kind of leave it. So when we're ready to use it, we're just going to use the, the car seat to reel it back in. So now all we need to do is put a big, fat, red button on the back of this armor. If I can, you know, just fit it on there. Like that. Okay, so now we have the big, fat, red button on the armor. So, now, uh, I'm just going to show you what the laser beam does. Yeah, it's very cool. So, uh, here we go. We've got our little our little armor pack on. So, now, oh, I'm, why am I so small? Why am I so small? Okay, you know, okay, let's just do this. So, we got to make this anchored off, collision off. So, we need to make all of this collision off. Oh boy. So, an easy way of doing this is just select all. Select the bits that are... Actually, all of this can basically be collision off. Yeah. So, now collision off like that. And we need to make this invisible. So, bam, 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 bam. Like that. Okay, now that you've done that, we need to do all of this and unanchor it. So, now... That you also, you're probably going to move a little bit weird if you jump, but, you know, that's just how the laser beam game works. So, are we ready? Why am I walking so weird? Are we ready to see the laser beam? Oh, my gosh. Oh, I forgot to reel it in. No! Uh, oh, jeez, give me a second. I need to reel it in, right, yeah. Forgot to reel it in. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, jeez, look at the binding. It's real weird. No, 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 I need to, this is why Earth Spike is better than Laser Beam, in my opinion, okay. So just reel this back in. Yeah, much better. Wait, why isn't it? Not all of it's reeling in, that's cringe. Eat all of it. 
to reel in. Okay, yeah, yeah, looking good. Okay, all right, we're good. Okay, now let's see if it works. Okay, now we're all we're not weird. Okay, ready? Oh, there you go. There you go. We got a big laser beam. All right, now you're probably. Oh, look, we can also cut through things like. All right, now I'm gonna show you the earth spike. Uh, so that's how you do the laser beam. And this is probably this is like a one-time use. So once you're done, you just kind of, because so, you can't reel it back in. Because build a boat, um, build a boat's buttons have a certain range. I think that needs to change. Chill throw. So, anyways, I'm gonna show you how to do the earth spike. The earth spike has an infinite use. That's another reason why the earth spike is better. But anyways, so I actually made a mech with superpowers. So that's pretty cool. I'm gonna show it to you right now. No, I made a mech with superpowers, so you know, yeah. All right, now we're gonna get our little candy here. I'm gonna get on the back of it, and there. So basically, how that works: there's an invisible thing, and all of these pistons are doing things. So I'm gonna show you it. So this is the the ninja guy. He's a he's like a he's a he's a ninja. Okay, so uh, this is uh, the ancient slash. It's like a thruster right there, and it pure shoots out with butter. Uh, all collision off. This is uh, the ancient sword and the rock spike kind of thing. So, let me show you this. This is the rock spike. So, it comes up and stabs. It's, by the way, collision off dynamite does work. So, it comes up and blows up your enemy. This one is the forbidden sword, I think. Yeah, there you go. The forbidden blade. You can slash some enemies right there. And now, finally, ancient slash. The big, this, this big one. Ancient slash and then your enemies will die so that is how you make superpowers in build a bit and i think it is very cool uh i hope you guys enjoyed the video remember to leave a like and subscribe and i will i will see you i will see you guys later